This is planet possibility, and here's what would happen if the sun exploded tomorrow. It's a scenario straight out of science fiction, a cosmic nightmare that could obliterate life as we know it. But what if it wasn't fiction? What if tomorrow the star that sustains us decided to go supernova? Imagine a normal day, birds sing, children play, you sip your morning coffee, oblivious to the celestial drama about to unfold. But deep within the heart of our sun, a monstrous instability is brewing. Temperatures soar to unimaginable levels. Pressure skyrockets and then, in a blinding flash, the sun explodes. The first sign of something amiss wouldn't be visual, at least not for us on Earth. The true harbinger of doom would be a shockwave of neutrinos, tiny, almost massless particles that travel at nearly the speed of light. These ghostly particles would wash over our planet in an instant, carrying with them the first whispers of the sun's demise. As the neutrinos pass through us, we wouldn't feel a thing, but scientists with the right equipment would notice they'd detect a sudden spike in neutrino activity, a clear sign that something catastrophic has occurred. Minutes later, the light from the explosion would reach us. The sky would light up brighter than a thousand full moons. Day would turn into a blinding, searing light. Panic would ensue as the world grapples with the sudden change. The heat from the explosion would start to affect our atmosphere causing temperatures to rise rapidly. Plants would begin to wilt, and water bodies would start to evaporate. Humanity would scramble for shelter, but there would be no escape from the relentless heat. In a matter of hours, the surface of our planet would become uninhabitable. The sun, now a supernova, would mark the end of life on Earth as we know it. A star's demise, and with it, our own. Eight minutes later, the light from the explosion would reach Earth. This light, traveling at the speed of light, would be the first harbinger of the cataclysm to come. But instead of the familiar warmth, we would be bathed in an unimaginable searing heat, a heat so intense that it would dwarf anything humanity has ever experienced. This light would be a billion times brighter than a thousand suns, a blinding radiance that would overwhelm our atmosphere. The sky would erupt in a blinding white light, instantly vaporizing everything in its path. Oceans would boil away, turning into steam in mere moments. Mountains would turn to molten slag, their solid forms melting like wax under a blowtorch. The very air we breathe would ignite into a fiery inferno, transforming the atmosphere into a sea of flames. Earth would be transformed into a scorched, lifeless wasteland, a charred remnant of its former self. But the devastation wouldn't stop there. The initial destruction would only be the beginning. The shockwave, traveling at the speed of light, would rip through the solar system, a relentless force of destruction. It would tear apart planets and asteroids like a cosmic hurricane, leaving nothing but chaos in its wake. Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, none would be spared the sun's wrath these giants of our solar system would be engulfed in flames and shattered. The delicate balance of our solar system, held together by the sun's immense gravity for billions of years, would be shattered in an instant. Planets would drift aimlessly, their orbits disrupted, and the once harmonious dance of celestial bodies would descend into chaos. So why would the sun explode? This question might seem alarming, but it's a fascinating topic in astrophysics. Well, thankfully, it's highly unlikely. Our sun is not destined for such a violent end. Our sun is a yellow dwarf star, a relatively small and stable celestial object. It's one of the many stars in the universe that enjoys a long, steady life. It doesn't have enough mass to go supernova. Supernovae are the spectacular deaths of much more massive stars. A star explodes when it runs out of fuel. This is a dramatic event, but it's not in the cards for our sun. For most of its life, a star fuses hydrogen into helium in its core, releasing enormous amounts of energy in the process. This fusion is what makes stars shine so brightly. This energy counteracts the inward pull of gravity, keeping the star in balance. It's a delicate equilibrium that allows the star to remain stable for billions of years. But eventually the star will exhaust its hydrogen fuel. This is an inevitable part of a star's life cycle. When this happens, the core collapses and the star begins to fuse heavier elements like helium and carbon. This marks the beginning of the end for many stars. This process releases even more energy, causing the star to expand into a red giant. Our sun will also go through this red giant phase, swelling up and engulfing the inner planets. For massive stars, this process continues until the core is made of iron. Iron is the last element that can be fused in a star's core. Iron cannot be fused into heavier elements, 
so the core collapses catastrophically, triggering a supernova explosion. This is one of the most powerful events in the universe, but it's not something our sun will experience. Thankfully, our sun is far too small to experience this kind of violent end. It will eventually run out of hydrogen fuel, but instead of exploding, it will expand into a red giant engulfing Mercury, Venus, and possibly even Earth. But that's billions of years in the future. But let's go back to our hypothetical scenario. Let's say the sun did explode. Is there any chance of survival? The short answer is highly unlikely. The immediate effects of the explosion would be unsurvivable on Earth's surface. The intense heat, radiation and shockwave would obliterate all life. However, some have theorized that survival might be possible deep underground. A sufficiently fortified bunker, shielded from the initial blast and equipped with its own energy and life support systems, could potentially provide refuge from the sun's fury. But even if such a bunker could withstand the initial blast, the long-term prospects are bleak. The Earth would be plunged into perpetual darkness and extreme cold. The atmosphere would be stripped away and the surface would be bombarded with deadly radiation. Even if some humans managed to cling to survival in these subterranean shelters, they would face a daunting and uncertain future. The world they once knew would be gone, replaced by a hostile and unforgiving environment. The hypothetical explosion of our sun is a stark reminder of the immense power of the cosmos and the fragility of our existence. It's a scenario that underscores the importance of appreciating the life-giving energy of our star and the preciousness of our planet. While the likelihood of the sun exploding tomorrow is infinitesimally small, the thought experiment serves as a powerful reminder of the vastness and power of the universe we inhabit. It also highlights the importance of continued exploration and the search for life beyond Earth. For even if our sun were to meet an untimely demise, the universe is filled with billions upon billions of other stars, some of which may harbor planets capable of supporting life.